Oh, hey, didn't see you there. Um, NBA 201, right? I heard y'all having a little bit of trouble understanding FIFO and LIFO in the perpetual and periodic system. Well, guess what? Me and my friends put together a little rap to help break it down for y'all. So let's get it going. I was gonna wear these glasses, but I can't see out of them, so we just gonna get started. Religion, FIFO and LIFO, tell a friend, got all these methods in my head, and I'm about to bring it in. Talking about inventory in the periodic system. There's a method to the madness, I'll explain it, don't you miss them. We gonna start with FIFO, that's that first in, first out, and it means what it says, go in depth with it now. Cash flows in the order that the goods are received, ending inventory gets calculated and repeat. Reel it in, FIFO and LIFO, tell a friend, got all these methods in my head, and I'm about to bring it in. Let me tell you about that lipo, that's that last in, first out. Cash flows in reverse of the order, no doubt. That means cost of goods sold has to start at the bottom. If ending inventory starts from the top, then I got them. The periodic system is different than the perpetual, but don't think too hard about it. I'ma keep it simple for the periodic system. Just calculate at the end for perpetual. Pay attention to the dates, my friend. Reel it in, by phone and lifeboat, tell a friend, got all these methods in my head, and I'm about to bring it in, yeah, shouts out to Dr. Evans' class, MBA 201, Onyx 12 at HU, we in here, young scholars, peace. Mm -hmm.